out here going to show you a car one-way smoke that extinguishes the terrace molly and allows CTs to peek down banana. So as you see here, and he's the opera, he had the best spawn. He's going to be peeking car. Kerserto with the second best spawn is going to throw the smoke. It's going to bounce off the wall. There's a terrorist molly. Extinguishes it. And Henny peeks from right there. You can barely see him. And he kills Stewie. So let's take a look at it from their POVs. As you see, Henny has the best spawn with the op. He is going to go rush Banana and peek from right side car. The smoke's going to be thrown from his teammate to extinguish any mollies. Also, before Henny reaches to the car, he is actually going to molly in between logs and brim. So I'm going to slow it down here in a bit. There's the molly. And let's play in four times speed. Right there. As you see, Stewie sees a smoke and he automatically preempts to shoot where Henny is. But it's really hard to see, which I'll show you from Stewie's perspective here in a bit. And he's going to fall off. Look at from Stewie's perspective here. He's in a molly car, but that car molly gets extinguished by that smoke. So let's see if we could spot him. Nah, we couldn't spot him from this angle because Stewie was swung all the way to the left. Look at from this angle here. There, he just got shot. You can you can't even see him. Gearster has the second best spawn. He's gonna throw the smoke that lands at Carr. He's gonna line himself in this corner and he's gonna aim in between the intersection of this antenna. And it's gonna bounce off this wall and extinguish the molly. So remember, he has the second spawn and he's gonna line up that wall and throw it at the intersection. Bounce off the wall, he's gonna smoke off that molly. Runs back and buys a flash and goes back to A. He has the third spawn. All he's going to do is going to flash for Henny to peek. Around 146 is when Terrace get up to Banana. And then he's going to throw a nade. And fall off. Gen G is going to use the car one-way smoke as a way to double peek it. So automatic with the best spawn, opping, is going to peek from half wall. While Kusa with the second best spawn is going to peek from car, and Bentet with the third spawn is going to be throwing the utility. Automatic is going to throw a flash, a deep flash, to prevent any terrorist holding car or half wall. Because once this smoke is thrown, it's obvious that sometimes somebody can be peeking from this angle. So Kusa gets a kill on config, leaving automatic solo half wall while both players Bentet Kusa rotate off. Poison's gonna try to peek automatic with a flash. Automatic kills him with <coughs> blind. Excuse me. At this point it's a 5v3. Automatic still holding half wall. Let's pull us a rotation back towards B. Automatic gets blind again. 5v3. They play it more passively here, boosting a player CT. So has the second best spawn. He's gonna peek from car, right side. Here comes a smoke. Smoke the molly, catch his config. And both of them rotate off to A. And with the third spawn, it's going to be smoking car. And then he's going to be throwing a flash. Line up the corner, aims at the bottom of the intersection, flashes over at 146. And if need be, he has a molly. And then they both rotate out once automatic has control. Take a look at it from Convict's POV. He's gonna get actually flash from automatic's flash. So remember when I said that someone could be holding this angle here or from the left side where Convict would be? That's what automatic flash does. It's gonna bite him off the angle. I'm gonna put it in slow mo here to see if we can see Kusta. Can't even see Kusta. 